Pastor Dow out here on, on social media. God bless you all. I have my best friend here, Kenneth Wayne W. Paramore, out of Akron, Ohio. We are here uh, <laughs> to bring to you a concept and our next venture, not just the two churches, New Shield of Faith and Spread the Word. Christ Center Church East and West Campuses in Akron and Young, excuse me, Barberton and Youngstown, Ohio. Yes, we have come and uh, we have, uh, because of a godly friendship for over oh, many years, we have come to introduce uh, uh, what God has put on our heart as a new ministry or a uh, uh, new reformation for the body of Christ and uh, we're here in Atlanta, Georgia. He flew down to the, yesterday all the way uh, from Atlanta, Georgia to do what God has put on our hearts between both churches, amen, and to uh, uh, allow the churches to be a part of what we're doing now. And uh, we just want to bring a word to you all about what we're doing. And uh, Bishop, will you introduce the first one? Yes, we are embarking on lifted reformation of Christian churches. And what that is, it's not a fellowship, it is a reformation, which means God has placed it on our hearts to try to reform uh, the body of Christ in the 21st century. Um, John and I have been best friends for 27 years, and a good part of that 27 We've been talking about what we could do to make the church better. And what we're going to do is try to bring our, our ministries, our pastorates, and even our people together to forge forward a better way of doing ministry for the inner city church, in particular, the black church located in the inner city. Yes. And, and we use this platform now as just an introductory, uh, as a, uh, a blurb or blog or whatever, to let you know and to uh, make you aware of what we are doing to, uh, so it just don't spring up on you when it comes. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be uh, exhilarating what we're uh, trying to do and not even trying, but what we are going to do. I want the people excited. I want everybody to open up your ears and your hearts and let us uh, take us uh, into the 21st century church. Uh, we are pretty unorthodox as it is as four churches, but uh, we're gonna capitalize on that freeness and on that, uh, 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 the ability to give people to understand that God's church is evolving God, God church is changing, God church is moving, and it is developing, not only developing people, but I think it's developing communities, That's right. developing cities. It's, it should be a, a, a mechanism, and we have to move the church back into uh, a preferred uh, a, a venue and a preferred uh, part of people's life, not just an afterthought. We need the church to be a preferred uh, entity in people's lives. What do you think? I, I think you hit the nail on the head. I think that the church has retreated back into the sanctuary over the last 50, 60 years, and we're making a deliberate effort to push the church back into the community where it belongs, uh, not just having church houses in the community, but actually having the work being manifested in the community. We are working on some things now that won't just be exciting, they'll be groundbreaking and cutting edge. And I think the thing that makes me most excited is one, it's the Lord's work, but two, I get to do it with my friend. So I'm excited about what the Lord is doing. Yeah, and, and, and one more thing I, I think that is important is that you build something that will last generations far beyond us. Oh yeah. And that will not just uh, uh, do something for who we're servicing now, but the people in our generations will feel the impact of, uh, of what Lifted Reformation is all about. Lifted Re Reformation, I believe and we believe, 
that it will be here to guide the church into the next millenniums to come. Absolutely. The next, the next future Absolutely. of church. Not just screens, and, but works. People working with people, people helping people, people doing stuff for people. And there must be a collective uh, 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 group to do this. Now, we're not uh, doing it by ourselves, but we're calling for the whole body of Christ to get with Amen. us Amen. and to uh, 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 first just uh, hear us out, listen to what we're doing, and uh, I think it's going to turn into something wonderful. We, we will change what church looks like for the next 100 years at least. Yes. I yes. will change the trajectory of the church, and, and I'm excited about those who aren't with us yet, that will be with us shortly when they find out how God is moving and that God wants to use us in the movement uh, uh, that he's commencing. So be looking for us. We're looking for you, and we're looking for helpers. The harvest is plenteous, mm. but the labors are few, and we're praying uh, to the God of the harvest that he'll send more workers, more laborers to get this done. Amen. God bless you. God bless you all.